Hey, it's Angela, your petite style coach, here with today's Friday Fashion Fix. Now, if you've ever watched Project Runway, chances are you've seen Nina Garcia at the end during the judging portion. She's sitting in her director's chair, critiquing everybody's looks. She throws up her hands and is like, the proportion, the proportion is all wrong. Now, I don't know about you, but I hate it when people tell me what not to do, but they don't tell me what to do instead. So that's what today's tip is all about. It's all about the right proportion for petites. Now, there are, depending upon your height and your body shape, there's several proportions that will work for you. However, this is the quickest, the most universally flattering, and it's the easiest one to implement right away. Now, when you start using this proportion filter, when you start putting your outfits through this like new um, awareness that you have, it's gonna help you in two super specific ways. The first one is you go into your closet and you look at all these separates, dresses and pants and all of that, and you're trying to pair them together to be the most flattering outfit possible. This is going to help you like crazy pants. The second one is, um, when you're shopping and you're trying to decide, oh, I don't know, is this item good, is it not good? When you put it through this proportion filter, you will walk away with better purchases and you're less likely to make uh, buy items that you get home and you're like, what the heck was I thinking? So let's dive in. Now, first things first, there are very few women on the planet who say, petite women, who say, I really wish my torso looked longer. And I've never heard a petite woman say, I really wish my legs looked shorter. So this tip is going to help with both of those things. Now, the first thing that we have to do is figure out where your visible waistline is. And it's super easy. All you have to do is stand up, bend your arm and place your elbow right along the side of your body. Wherever it hits, that is your visible waistline. Now, doesn't matter where your waistline actually is, this is where we wanna create the illusion that it is. So what that means is the top of your waistband, whether it be a skirt or pants, you want it to hit you right there. What that's gonna do is that's going to make it look like two thirds of your height come from your legs. And it's gonna make it look like there's only one third of your height that comes from your waist to the top of your head. So I'm gonna step back just so you can see now you can tell with me leaving my shirt untucked, it, I'm actually chopping myself into two equal size portions, 50% from my legs, 50% from my body. That is a rarely an attractive proportion on anyone, but especially with petites. However, all I have to do is flash my abs at you, tuck in my, tuck in my blouse and all of a sudden, not only do my legs look so much longer, but the whole ensemble is more flattering. That's it. Just remember, from your vis visible waistline to the ground, two thirds. From your visible waistline to the top of your head, a third. When you put your outfits together through that little equation, you are gonna end up with a much better result, so much easier, right? All right, that's all for now. I would love for you to try it out and then pop any comments or questions that you have into the comments below. I will get back to you right away and I will see you next Friday for next week's Friday Fashion Fix. See you later, bye-bye.